profession to which you will eventually belong and you will on all occasions maintain its purity and reputation. By virtue of your authority vested in me as the principal of Chief Kerala College of Engineering and Technology, I admit you to the degrees for which you have been declared qualified by the JNU University Anantapur and Anantapuramu. So you can please take your seats. I invite the heads of various departments in alphabetical order to present the candidates of the department for the award of provisional certificates. Will the candidates for the degree of B.Tech in the Department of Civil Engineering kindly stand? Principal Sir, I present to you these candidates in person in the Department of Civil Engineering who have been certified after examinations to be duly qualified to receive the degree of JIT University Anantapur. In the name and on behalf of JNT University Anantapur, I admit you to the degree of BTEC in the Department of Civil Engineering and I charge you through, through your life to prove worthy of the degree. I also permit for the distribution of provision facilities. 1880 to I request the Honorable Vice Chancellor and Principal to distribute the certificates. Sir. Eighteen eighty one is zero one zero four. Eighteen eighty one is zero one zero five. Eighteen eighty one is zero one zero seven. Eighteen eighty one is zero one zero eight eight Sharon. 1880-10-109 M. Chiranjeevi 1880-10-110 S. Dharani 1880-10-31 S. Fayaza-Thiban 1880-10-113 R. Harish 1880-10-114 K. Jagadish 1880-10-115 T. J. Ram 1880-10-116 T. Jashwant 1880-10-117 B. Kavish Kusuma 1880-10-118 B. Kishore 1880-10-119 S. Mahbub Ali 1880-10-120 K. Mahendra 1880-10-121 T. Mahendra Reddy 1880-10-122 Yes, Manohar Babu. 1880-10-126. G. Monica. 1880-10-128. T. Prasilla. 1880-10-131. M. Ravitija. 1880-10-132. Sheikh Satham. 1880-10-134 Yen Sai Charan 1880-10-135 K. Sai Charan 1880-10-137 G. Sai Lasya 
एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन थर्टी एट इन साई वैष्णवी एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फोर जीरो वन फोर जीरो ईश शेखर गाव एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फोर्टी वन डी शशिकला एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फोर्टी टू डी शशांक रेड्डी एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फोर्टी थ्री शेख सुहेल अब्बास एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फोर्टी फोर शेख सुहेल एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फोर्टी फाइव टी श्री विद्या एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फोर्टी एट एन स्वर्णलता एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फोर्टी नाइन आर तेजस्वी एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फाइव जीरो एस तरुण एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फिफ्टी वन बी त्रंबकेश्वर एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फिफ्टी फोर बी तलारी मनुजा एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फिफ्टी फाइव सी वेंकट प्रत्युषा एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फिफ्टी सिक्स पी विष्णु एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फिफ्टी एट जी यशवंत एटीन एटी वन एट जीरो वन फिफ्टी नाइन शेख जहीर बादशाह एटीन एटी फाइव एट जीरो ट्रिपल वन एम वीरेश नाइनटीन एटी फाइव एट जीरो वन जीरो वन के हरिकृष्णा नाइनटीन एटी फाइव एट जीरो वन जीरो टू एन महेश बाबू नाइनटीन एटी फाइव एट जीरो वन जीरो थ्री बी रोहित नाइनटीन एटी फाइव एट जीरो वन जीरो फोर टी शिवकृष्ण
then the candidate for the degree of B.Tech in Department of Computer Science and Engineering kindly stand. Principal sir, I present to you these candidates in person in the Department of Computer Science and Engineering who have been certified after examination to be duly qualified to receive the degree of JNT University Anantapur. In the name on in the name and on behalf of JNT University Anantapur, I admit you to the BTEC in the Department of Computer Science Engineering and I charge you throughout your life to prove worthy of the degree. I also permit for the distribution of provisional certificates. I request our VC sir and Kudlai sir
बिंदु 1881A0531 P Charani 1881A0532 K Chinmay 1881A0533 A Deekshita 1881A0534 J Devi Bhavani 1881A0535 B Dharani 1881A0536 B Dheeraj 1881A0538 E Divya 1881A0539 K Durga Akanksha 1881A0540 M Farzan 1881A0541 Sheikh Firoz Begum 1881A0542 Saniya Firdos 1881A0543P Gangadhar Reddy 1881A0544K Geeta Lakshmi 1881A0545 C Harshita 
हेमंत पंकज राम एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव फिफ्टी शेख इमरा Eighteen eighty one A zero five fifty one P Ismail. Eighteen eighty one A zero five fifty two P Janaki Ram Vamshi. Eighteen eighty one A zero five fifty four O Jyoti Swarupa. Eighteen eighty one A zero five fifty five D Jyoti Mai. Eighteen eighty one A zero five fifty six S Josna. Eighteen eighty one A zero five fifty seven Kai Ahmed. 1881 A0558 B Kirtana 1881 A0559 C Kirti Eighteen eighty one A zero five sixty P Khalil. Eighteen eighty one A zero five sixty one E Lahari. Eighteen eighty one A zero five Eighteen eighty one A zero five sixty two Y Lahari. Eighteen eighty one A zero five sixty three D Lina Goyal. Eighteen eighty one A zero five sixty five S Lokesh Kumar. Eighteen eighty one A zero five sixty six Sheikh Mohammed Fayaz. Eighteen eighty one A zero five sixty seven C 
Nancy Manisha. Eighteen eighty one A zero five sixty eight made a varam Lakshmi Ranga Mayura Nityashri. Eighteen eighty one A zero five sixty nine OMD Zubair Basha. Eighteen eighty one A zero five seventy K Meghna. Eighteen eighty one A zero five seventy one Sheikh Nizban Rain. 1881A0573 Sheikh Muhammad Rafi 1881A0574 Sheikh Muhammad Afnan Akif Eighteen eighty one A zero five seventy five G Maunika. Eighteen eighty one A zero five seventy six K Maunika. Eighteen eighty one A zero five seventy seven M Maunika. Eighteen eighty one A zero five seventy eight N Maunika. Eighteen eighty one year zero five seventy nine Sheikh Muzaffar Rahman. Eighteen eighty one year zero five eighty Sheikh Nafis. Eighteen eighty one year zero five eighty one G Naga Varshik. Eighteen eighty one year zero five eighty two P Naga Kavya. Eighteen eighty one year zero five eighty three P Nandini. Eighteen eighty one year zero five eighty five K Nila Kantam.
निखिला एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव नाइन्टी वन एस नीतीश एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव नाइन्टी फोर क्रिस नोयल ओला एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव नाइन्टी फाइव शेख उस्मान बाशा एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव नाइन्टी सिक्स बी पूजिता एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव नाइन्टी सेवन जी पूजिता एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव नाइन्टी एट यू पूजिता एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव ए टू वाई प्रशांति एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव ए थ्री के प्रशांत राज एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव ए फोर एम प्रत्युषा एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव ए फाइव पी प्रीतम एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव ए सेवन एम रचना रेड्डी एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फाइव ए एट के राघश्री एटीन 
1881A05B1E Ravindra Gaud. Eighteen eighty one year zero five B three Ye Rohini eighteen eighty one year zero five B four Sheikh Raushini Tabasum. Eighteen eighty one year zero five B five K Sahiti eighteen eighty one year zero five B six Sai Charan Reddy. Eighteen eighty one year zero five B seven P Sai Cherita eighteen eighty one year zero five B eight C Sai Aishwarya Singh. Eighteen eighty one year zero five C zero P Sai Saujanya. Eighteen eighty one year zero five C one N Sai Shruti. Eighteen eighty one year zero five C two. P Sai Tejashwini. Eighteen eighty one A zero five C four M Seva Nandu. Eighteen eighty one A zero five C five Heba Shabreen. Eighteen eighty one A zero five C six B Shanmukha Priya. Eighteen eighty one A zero five C seven A Shanti Priya. Eighteen eighty one A zero five C eight M Sirisha. Eighteen eighty one A zero five C nine K Shivani. Eighteen eighty one A zero five D two Sindhu Sri. Eighteen eighty one year zero five D three ye Sirisha. Eighteen eighty one year zero five D 
ಶ್ರವಂತಿ ಶ್ರೀಚಂದನ Eighteen eighty one eight zero five E eight B Sri Nidhi. Eighteen eighty one eight zero five F zero P Subba Tejashwini. ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೈವ್ ಎಫ್ ತ್ರೀ ಜಿ ಸುಪ್ರಿಯಾ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೈವ್ ಎಫ್ ಫೋರ್ ಎನ್ ಸುಪ್ರಿಯಾ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೈವ್ ಎಫ್ ಫೈವ್ ಕೆ ಶ್ವೇತ ಉದಯ್ ಕಿರಣ್ ರೆಡ್ಡಿ ಅಹಮದ್ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೈವ್ ಜಿ ಟು ಶೇಖ್ ವಾಲಿ ಅಹಮದ್ 
చూస్తారు ఆలోచన పెళ్ళికి అయితే తయారైనాక పెళ్ళి ఎవరు ఉంటారు అసలు అసలు చూస్తారు గూగుల్కి Will the candidates for the degrees of B.Tech in Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering kindly stand? Principal sir, I present to you these candidates in person in the Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering who have been certified after examination to be July qualified to receive the degree of JNT University Anantapur. In the name and on behalf of JNT University Anantapur, I admit you to the degree of B.Tech in the Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering and I charge you to work in your life to prove worthy of the degree. I also permit for the distribution of provisional certificates. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four zero two. Yes, Abhishek. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four zero three Adam Ali. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four zero four Afrid Basha. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four zero five Pinjari Afrin Eighteen eighty one eight zero four zero six Aftab Siddiqui Eighteen eighty one eight zero four zero seven Akil Prabhu eighteen eighty one eight zero four zero eight Akilesh Kumar eighteen eighty one eight zero four zero nine Amulia. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four one zero Aravin eighteen eighty one eight zero four eleven Arun Kumar eighteen eighty one eight zero four twelve Arzia. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four one three Sheikh Asma eighteen eighty one eight zero four one four Asmatullah
uh, students are informed to please be seated. Yes. All the EC students may kindly stand, but I request all the remaining students to please be seated in their seats. Once you receive the certificates from the chief guest on the bus, please go back to your seats and please be seated in your seats. I request all the students not to kindly leave their seats. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four one five Chenna Baswa. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four one six Bhagyasri. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four one seven Bharani Kumari. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four one eight Boya Bhavani. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four one nine. Yes, Bhavya. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four twenty one. Chakrada ready. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four twenty two. Chandra Harika. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four twenty three. Boya Chandrika. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four twenty four. Charan Kumar Reddy. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four twenty five Charani eighteen eighty one eight zero four twenty eight Devendra Reddy eighteen eighty one eight zero four twenty nine Dhanalakshmi eighteen eighty one eight zero four thirty Dheeraj Eighteen eighty one eight zero four thirty one B Divya eighteen eighty one eight zero four thirty two Divya Sai Eighteen eighty one eight zero four thirty three Divya Sri. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four thirty four Ganesh. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four thirty five K Gayatri eighteen eighty one eight zero four thirty six A Gautami eighteen eighty one eight zero four thirty nine Harish. Eighteen eighty one eight zero four forty one Prema Priya Eighteen 
1880442 हेमंत कुमार एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फोर्टी थ्री वाई इंद्रावती एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फोर्टी फोर जगदीश एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फोर्टी सिक्स जयपाल एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फोर्टी सेवन जैसमिन एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फोर्टी नाइन जय सूर्य राज एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फिफ्टी शेख जीलान एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फिफ्टी वन के जोशना एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फिफ्टी टू जे कविता एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फिफ्टी थ्री बी कोटेश एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फिफ्टी फोर बी तांडव कृष्णा रेड्डी एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फिफ्टी फाइव कृष्ण तेजा एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फिफ्टी सिक्स कृष्ण तुलसी एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर फिफ्टी सेवन एम लहरिका एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर सिक्सटी यू माधुरी एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर सिक्सटी टू जे महेंद्र एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर सिक्सटी फाइव जे मनीष यादव एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर सिक्सटी सिक्स ई मेघना एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर सिक्सटी नाइन सैयद मोहम्मद अजीज एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर सेवेंटी शेख मोहम्मद अतीक अदनन
जीएन मुखार मोहम्मद एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर सेवेंटी सिक्स शेख मुनवर बाशा एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर सेवेंटी सेवन के नाव माधुरी एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर सेवेंटी नाइन Injury Nasreen 1880 Yabin 1880-1481 Boya Nabin 1881-0482 यंग नवीन कुमार YouTube लो कमेंट्स राख कुन्ना हेल्प जा रहा था आज मानो ना तो लिंक वाले चुना रहा था लिंक वाले चुना रहा था अलग चप्पे से फोन चप्पे से 1881-0484 कोटिपल निवास YouTube लो वीडियो चुस्ती कमेंट्स उन्हें अभी लिंक कमेंट्स हम राख कुन्ना हेल्प जा रहा था 1881-0486 P. Pallavi That's the link to the link. There are no comments. 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 1881-0487 G. Pavan Yes, there are no comments. 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 1881 जी पवन कुमार चेला ना है ना क्या आने फोन ये लाना है सारा मतलब 1881-0489 के पवन कुमार 1881-0490 1881-0491 T. Pavan Kumar Adav 1881-0492 Y. Pavani एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर नाइन्टी थ्री यस प्रभाकर एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर नाइन्टी फोर यम प्रत्युषा एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर नाइन्टी सेवन यम प्रियंका एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर नाइंटी एट बी शेख रबानी एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर ए जीरो पी राजन्ना एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो फोर ए टू यंग राकेश एटी 
ಬಾಬು ಬತ್ತುಲ ಸುಷ್ಮಿತಾ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಇ ಫೈವ್ ಕೆ ಶ್ವೇತಾ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಇ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಕುರುಪ ಶ್ವೇತಾ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಇ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಸಿ ಎ ತೇಜೇಶ್ ವರ್ಮಾ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಎಫ್ ಒನ್ ಆರ್ ಒನ್ಸೀದರ್ ರೆಡ್ಡಿ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಎಫ್ ಟು ಟಿ ಒನ್ಸೀದರ್ ರೆಡ್ಡಿ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಎಫ್ ಫೋರ್ ಕೆ ವಂದನಾ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಎಫ್ ಫೈವ್ ಬಿ ವರ ಪುಷ್ಪಾವತಿ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಎಫ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಬಿ ವಾಸವಿ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಎಫ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಬಿ ಸಮುದಿತ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಎಫ್ ಏಟ್ ವೆಂಕಟ ಜಾಹನವಿ ಸಾಯಿ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಎಫ್ ನೈನ್ ಟಿ ವೆನ್ನೆಲ್ಲ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜಿ ಜೀರೋ ಬಿ ವೇಣುಗೋಪಾಲ್ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜಿ ಒನ್ ಬಿ ವಿಕ್ಟರ್ ಪ್ರಣೀತ್ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜಿ ಟು ಸಿ ವಿಮಲಾ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜಿ ಫೋರ್ ಕೆ ವಿಶ್ವಪ್ರಿಯ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜಿ ಫೈವ್ ಕೆ ವಿಷ್ಣುವರ್ಧನ್ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜಿ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಎಸ್ ವಿ ವೈಶಾಲಿನಿ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜಿ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಹೆಚ್ ಈರೇಂದ್ರನಾಥ್ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜಿ ಏಟ್ ಸಿ ಯೋಗೇಶ್ವರಿ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜಿ ನೈನ್ ಬಿ ವೈಷ್ಣವಿ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಹೆಚ್ ಜೀರೋ ಸೈಯದ್ ಫಹದ್ ಪೀರ್ ಏಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಒನ್ ಎ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಹೆಚ್ ಒನ್ ಕೆ ಭರತ್
ಎಂ ಮಲ್ಲೇಶ್ವರಯ್ಯ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಏಟ್ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಜೀರೋ ಏಟ್ ಎಂ ಮನೀಷ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಏಟ್ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಒನ್ ಜೀರೋ ಬೀದೇಶ್ ರಫೀಕ್ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಏಟ್ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಸಿ ರಂಗಣ್ಣ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಏಟ್ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಫೋರ್ಟೀನ್ ಎಸ್ ರವೀಂದ್ರ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಏಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಏಟ್ ಜೀರೋ ಫೋರ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟೀನ್ ನರಹರಿ ಸಾಯಿ ಚರಣ್ 1985-0417 M. Sai Monika 1985-0418 T. Sai Vishita 1985-0419 Telugu Sai Naja 1980-580-420 M. Sivanagamani 1980-580-421 B. Sri Charan 1985-0422 V. Supriya 1985-0423 K. Naveen Kumar 1980-580-424 G. Venkata Sai Kumar 1980-580-425 P. Pradeep Sai 1980-580-426 Krishnamagadi Sarak Kumar Reddy 1881-801-B Achit Narayana 1881-802-K Amaresh 
की साई जाहने भी एटी एटी वन ए जीरो टू फोर एट शेख समीर एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू फिफ्टी के शेषाद्री एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू फिफ्टी थ्री पी श्री लक्ष्मी एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू फिफ्टी फोर ए सुष्मिता एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू फिफ्टी फाइव ए मोहम्मद तब्रिज एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू सिक्सटी के वंशीधर रेड्डी एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू सिक्सटी वन के वीरेश कुमार एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू सिक्सटी टू यू विनय एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू सिक्सटी थ्री आई विराजिता एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू सिक्सटी फोर आर विष्णुवर्धन एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू सिक्सटी फाइव एस विवेक एटीन एटी वन ए जीरो टू सिक्सटी सेवन बी योगेश्वर यादव नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू नाट वन डी अलग बादशाह नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू नाट टू बी हिमावन नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू नाट थ्री बी स्माइल नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू नाट फोर जी लक्ष्मी नारायण नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू नाट फाइव एस मोहिनीदेन नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू नाट नईन एम श्रीराम स्वरूप नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू टेन टी विजय भारद्वाज नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू लेवन बै विवेक वर्धन नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू टूव के कल्याण चक्रवर्ती नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू फोर्टीन ए अरुण नाइनटीन एटी फाइव ए जीरो टू फिफ्टीन एम चिरंजीवी 
1985-0217 D. Dana Prasad 1985-0218 M. Ishwar 1985-0220 T. Ganesh 1985-0222 K. Karthik 1985-0224 P. Mahmud Basha 1985-0225 B. Mahalakshmi 1985-0226 M. Mahdur Rahman 1985-0227 T. Naganna 1985-0230 P. Punit Kumar 1985-0232 A. Raghavindradu 1985-0235 by Ravi Kumar 1985-0236 B. Ravi Kumar 1985-0237 U. Renka Devi 1985-0238 S. Sai Madhu 1985-0240 C. Shabarinath 1985-0242 M. Surendranath 1985-0244 K. Vaishnavi 1985-0247 B. Kumar 1985-0248 P. Praveen 1881-0243 J. Ravi Kumar 1881-0207 N. Charan Kumar 
to you the candidates in person who are eligible to receive eight gold medals from the honorable uh, chief guest five gold medals for being given to the toppers in individual uh, departments two gold medals to the overall girls topper and the uh, boys topper separately and finally one gold medal for the overall best topper i shall read out the names in the same order 1881801391 b shaker topper in the civil department he has got a ccp of 1881-0561, Ms. E. Lahari, Topper in the CSE Department with a CCP of 9.31. Mr. M. Sai Prakash Reddy, Department of uh, EC, with a CGP of 9.21.
Next, 1881-208, Mr. P. Dharan Kumar Reddy, Department of Ripley, with the CGP of 9.55. Next is 1980-580311, Mr. A. Suresh from Department of Mechanical Engineering with a CGP of 8.91. Next award is uh, overall Next award is overall goal stopper Ms. E. Lahari from Department of CAC with the CGP of 9.31. Uh, this is her second uh, gold medal. Next is overall boy stopper, Mr. P. Dharan Kumar Reddy from Department of Kipali with the CGP of 9.55. The same student got the overall best topper and this is the third award for him. Okay, now this is the overall topper award. It's a two thousand to my department of tripling with 9.55 CGPA. Third gold medal.
now I invite the principal of the college to present a report on the activities of the college. Thank you, sir. It's my honor to extend my cordial welcome to our chief guest, Professor G. Ranganath Janathan Garu, Honorable Vice Chancellor, JNTVA, guest of honor, Dr. E. S. Chakravarti Garu, Global Head, TCS, Bangalore, and Dr. U. Chandrasekhar Garu, Program Lead, Vipro 3D, Bangalore, Sri G. Gai Mohan Kumar Garu, Chairman, GPSET, Sri G. Pullai Garu, Secretary and Correspondent, GPSET, Professor R. Bhavani Garu, University Nominee, Members of Governing Body, HODs, Staff, Parents, and today's engineering graduates. A warm welcome to all for the first graduation day ceremony of G. Pulley College of Engineering and Technology, Karnal. I deem it as a privilege to present before you the overall report of the college. G. Pulley College of Engineering and Technology started in the year 2007, comprising of four courses with an intake of 240. At present, it is offering nine UG courses, four PG courses with a total intake of 945. Two new courses have been introduced this year in Computer Science and Engineering, that is Artificial Intelligence and Machine Learning and Computer Science Engineering Data Science, each with an intake of 60. The college has completed 50 years of academic excellence, imparting quality education with excellent infrastructure and making a significant contribution in the field of engineering education in the region of Karnal District, Andhra Pradesh. The institution has been granted autonomous status in the year 2018, besides being accredited by National Assessment and Accreditation Council, MAC, with A grade and also MD accreditation for three courses involving CSC, EC and PP. A total of 477 students, that is 85% of the students pertaining to 2018 batch, which is the first batch and autonomous structure, are being graduated. A total of 40 students have been graduated in distinction, while 150 students have graduated in first class and 25 students in second class. The campus placements this year have been extraordinary, where 95% of the eligible students have been placed in different companies such as TCS, Infosys, IBM, Wipro, Capgemini, Engineering Data, HCL, etc. with a salary package ranging from 4 lakhs to 10, 11 lakhs per annum. As a part of new initiatives introduced this year involving alumni talks and industry talks, we have connected 35 alumni talks and 15 industry talks this year wherein the students have interacted with alumni of the college along with industry people. We have also established Center of Advancement of Digital Manufacturing and Industrial IOP Lab in association with Vipro 3D Bangalore. The students of the college also regularly participate in various activities connected by Andhra Pradesh State Council of Higher Education and University, which include Microsoft Upscaling Program, Talk the Book, Quest Competition connected by State Council of Higher Education and so on. The various technical clubs of our college encourage our students by connecting various programs to gain knowledge, skills and experience in leadership, communication, problem solving, group development and management, presentation and public speaking. The college has also backed various ranks through various ranking agencies involving the WEEK, Heritage 360, India Today, Competition Success Review, etc. All the sales like Women Empowerment, Women Protection, NSS, EDC, R&D, Innovation, etc. are organizing regular programs to improve the individual and leadership abilities of students and make them successful in their careers. The institution has also successfully organized Sixth International Conference on Advances in Computing and Data Sciences in association with Springer during April 2022. A total of 175 papers have been published by our faculty and students along with 12 patents being filed. The institution has also been identified as Neural Center to, smart, to host Smart India Hackathon 2022. And also from this dais I, like I would also like to proudly share that one of our alumni by name Deepak Reddy he has directed a short film in Manasanama and it has won various accolades and awards in the recently uh, uh, short film festival house. With these few words, I would like to express my best wishes to every student for a bright future on this occasion of first graduation day. Thank you. Thank you. I request the guest of honor, Dr. U. Chanishikar Garu, program lead Vipro 3D Bangalore to deliver his address. Honorable Vice Chancellor, Jane to Antipur, Professor Angagaru, Professor Gayatri Vaidhan, 
uh, my industry colleague from Bangalore, PCS, Mr. Chakravarti Garo, the founders of this vibrant institution, uh, Mr. Mohan Kumar and his legendary father, Sri Pulai Garo, and most importantly, the VIPs of today's function, the students and their fam immediate families who are present and the faculty members. Indeed, it's an occasion of momentous importance as far as the college is concerned because it got autonomy, it got the freedom, it got the latitude in terms of experimentation with so many different innovations in the teaching learning methods. And the first batch, as it is stepping out in 2022, the entire fraternity connected with this batch is excited with the news that nearly 85 to 90 percent of the students who are passing out in this batch have secured placements in reputed organizations including as mentioned by principal TCS, Vipro, Capgemini, etc. Et so I will just conclude my talk with some few insights as a person who worked in the R&D lab of a government organization then worked in, in private industry. I also was part of the university ecosystem for many years, including a brief stint in IIT Bombay. The degree is just a preliminary visa to make the travel into the real world. If you are stepping out, what is going to happen is a world of opportunities unfolds in front of you. And fundamentally, I just want to give the very, very inspiring story from Shastra University wherein a person like all of us called Ganesh Matrubhutam passed out from a similar institution in Tanjavur called Shastra, those days Shanmukha Engineering College. And just about six or five months ago, the company which he started out of the campus called Fresh Works, it got listed in NASDAQ and he, it, was, it became a unicorn overnight and what is very important is 500 of the students who he took as initial set of employees from a small place like Tanjavur, they have become multi crore parties, bringing a tremendous metamorphosis in the entire family ecosystem which is these people are connected with. So fundamentally the value that he has brought in and the example that he has set in gives you a powerful message in thinking that whether you are a student of GPCET Karnool or a student of IIT Kharagpur or maybe a student of uh, Carnegie Mellon, it doesn't matter. The kind of opportunities which are unfolding in front of you are unprecedented. It's just not adequate if you think that you are getting into a job and you can remain stagnant with whatever salary you have got and be content with whatever you are going to earn. Fundamentally, the world is going to be full of vulnerabilities, uncertainties, complexities and as they also say, so much of interrelation which is not clear to us. Example, when Russia attacked Ukraine, Karnulo Petrol Dharalu so, some incident which is happening in remote part of the world is affecting so many things across the width and, uh, let's say, length of the world. So, what is that you can do is, to be extremely successful in terms of contribution to the system of which you are going to play the part, there are four attributes which you have been following as far as NBA is concerned. Knowledge and skill that can be measured with the help of tangible metrics and the behavior and attitude which cannot be measured in an objective way which are functions of so many things which happen in the college, which happens in your immediate friend circle, which also are function of what happens in your family and in terms of the best example from which you can seek inspiration. The Enterprises which are going to employ you will definitely appreciate in case you develop multidisciplinary kind of insight and your approach is towards development of creative solutions and your approach 
is towards problem solving. Fundamentally, these things are repeated quite many number of times. If you look at the NEP uh, document which has been released by the government of India under the chairmanship of uh, Dr. Kasturi Rangan sir, it makes a mention of the term interdisciplinary about 63 or 64 times. So I'll just give one example. If you look at the very famous Tejas aircraft which has been uh, developed with enormous impact on our defense by DIDO, Aeronautical Development Engin Agency, who do you ascribe the success to? It's not aeronautical engineer, it's not instrumentation engineer, it's not mechanical engineer, it's not uh, computer science, material science. Actually, it is a confluence of so many different disciplines of engineering and science. So, my simple observation is please do have this kind of a multidisciplinary kind of an attitude in approaching your workplace, the projects that you are going to be interested with and you just think that you are a lifelong learner lest your skills could be getting updated very very soon. It will be aspiration to be able to say that Sanskrit is not a Siddhi Bhavutu Karmaja. First, we have a Akanksha, 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 we have a Akanksha. So just make sure that you aspire for something very, very good, very tall in your life. And it's a matter of coincidence that the big companies like Google's and uh, technology companies like Google's and Microsoft are led by people who are as good or as normal as all of us. In fact, Mr. Satya Nadella passed out of MIT Manipal before he went to scale the highest echelons in the world as far as the technological company is concerned. So, good quality thinking which has been inculcated in the system, it gives rise to actually knowledge and knowledge makes you powerful and I sincerely wish that all of you become powerful and I conclude uh, my presentation with just a small anecdote uh, with which you can easily correlate because I was born and brought up in Karnal. I studied in Government Junior College. Uh, like you, we had a function in 1980, August. I belong to 1978-80 Government Junior College or Timaya College as it was known. And fundamentally, we had fantastic set of faculty members they kept saying that whether you are in a Karnal Government Junior College or not, as long as you are studying well, you can scale the highest positions in the ranks. So, those days, state rank was something unheard of. But we had phenomenal teachers, phenomenal inspirers. So, in 1980, when I passed out, I ended up getting, for the very first time in the history of Karnal, fifth rank in the intermediate. I am talking about something which happened many, many years ago. So, it was celebrated in a big way, but just hold, by 1984, the Government Junior College has so many ranks, including the first rank in intermediate, in the very same place. So, if you really want to scale the heights, sky is the limit. In fact, uh, Mr. Mohan Kumar was telling me yesterday that one of the early students of the G. Pulaya School is an IAS officer, and as mentioned by uh, the principal, one of your senior students has become a short filmmaker whose outcome is appreciated across the world with more than 150 accolades. So I really wish that all of you people pursue your life's goals with all the sincerity, with all the commitment, with all the dedication that is possible. Become good learners, become good thinkers, in the bargain become powerful and bring reputation to your family as well as all of us. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, sir. So to add up on uh, what Chai Shikha sir told, uh, I think in the year 1920, uh, with the initiation taken by Chai Shikha sir, uh, nearly, I, I think, 25 to 30 students have gone for three-week internship to Taiwan. And one of the faculty from Ravindra College of Engineering is pursuing his PhD in Taiwan with the initiation taken by Chai Shikha sir. So thank you very much for your support, sir. So now I request uh, uh, Chakravarti, sir, I mean shortly called as Chaks, 
to inspect this problem. Jai Shri Gurudev and my sincere pranams to all the parents and teachers who made us what we are today. Give a big round of appreciation in bringing all the hearts together to appreciate the contributions and amazing things that they did in our life for the betterment of us every day. My dear boys and girls, congratulations for successfully completing your engineering course and coming together in celebrating the graduation day celebrations of my favorite engineering institute in the state of Andhra Pradesh. Before I go any further, let me give you some compliments. You all look very smart today. I love you guys. Number two, I must compliment Mohanji for taking the feedback in one of the sessions that we must bring people together and do this graduation day celebrations. It's one of the dreams that we had in the past and that came into action today. My hats off to you for the commitment and my sincere compliments to you. Of course, every good thing will create more good opportunities for us to work upon. And I'd like to give you two important goals to take this forward. Number one, we started celebrating Freshers' Day, Induction Day, and we started celebrating Graduation Day. The seed has formed. Try to look at two more important functions that we must celebrate in this campus. And we must dedicate one day for innovation and call it as Innovation Day and bring the energy together and the students together every year. Not only the students of our institution, the students of surrounding institutions to come here and celebrate the importance of innovation, innovation and innovation. And let's call it as Innovation Day. The second thing that we must look at is start celebrating diversity. Mr. Mohan, nobody has thought in the state of Andhra Pradesh and even in the universities, the importance of diversity. Diversity is always seen as gender diversity, men versus women. But diversity goes into several roots of our living. I will give you a framework to celebrate the diversity in our institution and we must identify a day to bring the people together again to celebrate what exactly is the diversity in our life. So let's take these two as an important feedbacks and move forward. The third compliment is for the parents. I have seen my father and my mother dreaming of me as an individual and consistently working every day in their life in crafting my character, in crafting my success and in crafting my education. And the same thing is applicable for all the parents who are sitting here today. Whatever the respect I had towards my parents and the same respect I want to pay off today from this dais and say my sincere namaskarams to every parent sitting in this campus. So boys and girls, I don't know how many of you remember the old learning days that we had in our schools and correlate with the dress what you are wearing today, the dress of saffron. I don't know how many of you people remember what is the significance of color saffron during our education. And most of our priests and most of Gurujis and Swamijis in several years and centuries picked up this color and started wearing this as a standard dress code to demonstrate something in their life. And that is what the significance of 
the color of saffron color of saffron stands for sunset and sunrise the power of surya is demonstrated in this color saffron the power of sunrise and sunset number 2 the significance of saffron color lies in the fire that we go through the fire the agni agni and surya stands as significant contributors or demonstrations of color saffron you can learn from it today we are wearing that saffron color and trying to pick up your graduation day certificates must give us the next purpose of our life the next purpose of our life is using your education and demonstrating your knowledge to see the ups and downs of life just like our sunset and sun rise and being as strong as fire as wild as fire as intensity as fire in solving those ups and downs of your life is what exactly is the purpose of wearing that saffron color and picking up your graduation day certificates when i talk about sunrise i talk about opportunities that you have today most of you got jobs in various organizations especially thanks to wipro and thanks to cognizant and thanks to dxc for creating several offers for each one of you if something this batch will be remembered for the future it is the number of placements that you got in the last what is it you no know, couple of months this batch is a benchmark for placements in this college be proud of it and once you step out of the campus now not only the opportunity that you got today in your pocket but the life is full of opportunities always do remember the intensity of sunrise is absolutely equivalent to the intensity of the several opportunities that we have and of course we pursue technology and hence technology gives us tremendous amount of opportunities is something which is making a difference to the world today people with technology and we are the custodians of the technology hence opportunities are going to be like sunrise nobody can stop the opportunities what we get every day and when sun comes down that talks about the challenges that we go through in our life challenges with our family challenges with the surroundings challenges with the environment and challenges that we go through to hit the success the only solution for it is taking the inspiration from the fire the agni the fire stands for enthusiasm the fire stands for intensity the fire stands for the strength and the fire stands for many other things that we can take it and that will make you to be able to face those challenges and grab those opportunities what i mentioned and this is what exactly what you are supposed to do as youngsters one more very interesting thing that i would like to mention on this dais and i'm going to close it as quickly as possible because the day belongs to you please go and take as many photographs as possible give as many hugs as possible go and thank as many people as possible go to every corner of the college and take a photograph for your memory for the future of your references and that is what is the purpose of today and go to the certificate and see it for 10 times that this is exactly what i delivered as your first success in your life so that is what you were supposed to do on the graduation day not listen to our lectures but i'll tell you what covid taught us covid taught me only one thing eat well sleep well and exercise well if you look at 90% of the survivors of covid who went through hospitals they survived because of their nutrition they survived because of their cool and stable life and they survived because they used to exercise well especially the lungs became very strong because of that walk and run and fed meal that you do every day people who took a lot of long breaths their lungs became stronger and that was the only medicine and differentiator for people to get away from covid not exactly the medicines so that is what covid taught us is eat well each one of you all the parents don't ask for their salaries please don't ask for their salaries and i also want to tell the principal next time onwards only talk about placements don't talk about ctcs ctcs are just a reference today ctcs doesn't play any, any important role parents ask them every day have you slept well in the previous night 
As a parent, ask every day, have you taken the right nutritious food today? And ask your ward every day, have you gone through 30 minutes of exercise? Simple exercise. And today the nature tells us that the one sport which doesn't need any kind of investment is walking and running. Because today people are saying that running and walking on the barefoot is the most what is the you know, fruitful thing that you can do as an individual. Absolutely no investment, no expenses to go for 30 minutes of walk or run on a barefoot. Please ask all these questions every day to your son or a daughter. Don't ask about their career. Don't ask about their CTC and don't ask about what exactly they are doing in companies like Vipro, CTS and, and various other organizations. Talk about their eating, talk about their exercising and talk about their sleeping and finally you can ask one question. Are you enjoying your life every day? And if this girl boy says that yes I am enjoying today, that means they are on the right track. They are absolutely on the right track. So with this, not too much of what is that you know gyan for each one of you. Go and join Vipro, they will take care of you very nicely. Go and join CTS, they know how to nurture you. And whoever is left, please come and join TCS, they know how to nurture you. Right? So there is absolutely no need to worry about your future. There are only two, three things that you have to do. Number one, as part of your life, respect your parents and the villages and the nature that you belong to. As part of life, understand the importance of character compared to success and never ever lose the character. And as individuals always understand the importance of learning new things with enthusiasm, creativity and hard work and how to get those new competencies that you build into action in solving the problems. Important. Graduation day is a constant journey. It is not a destination. The actual learning will start from today. So graduation day doesn't end your learning. Actual learning, learning starts after the graduation day. So be a lifelong learner and be a consistent learner. And as I said, you will become the symbol of sunrise every day in your life. Just like my kids, I wish you all the very best. I want you to fly as much as possible the way I look at my kids in my home. All the best to you. Always take care of the parents for whom we are here today. Thank you so much. So thank you very much, sir. Right from the inception of the college, uh, which is, I mean, Chakravarti sir is giving, is uh, giving many challenges every year. So those challenges are making us to grow. So thank you so much, sir, for inspiring us. And one more thanks to Chakravarti sir is, uh, which is initiation, Randra College of Engineering for Women, got TCS affirmative program, where nearly 120 students are being trained by TCS. So thank you so much for providing that opportunity, sir. Now I request the chief guest. Uh, uh, the Vice Chancellor of the Interview, Ananda Pramu, Rangajanardana sir, to give his message. Good afternoon to everyone. <laughs> Secretary of the Education institution, uh, Sri G. Pulagal, Chairman of the Education Institution, Senior Faculty, Teaching Staff, Not Teaching Staff, Parents, the other guests, Press and Electronic Media, and finally, the end budding engineers who are graduating from this right, institution. Right. The first batch of uh, the Autonomous College of Zipulai College of Engineering and Technology, Karnul. Your principal has rightly pointed out the various uh, success stories of your uh, institution. And the two earlier speakers, with their vast experience, one is in uh, Government sector later moved to the IT, and the other one is who is uh, my best friend and also alma mater belongs to PhD College of Technology, Mr. Chakravarti. And whatever the points expressed by those by these two eminent personalities are true, but finally you will be in uh, doubt whether to enjoy or whether to concentrate on further studies. Because one point is, this is the 
time now we have to learn continuously in your uh, career i humbly request all the graduating students you keep your goal uh, which is much higher than your uh, capacity it is not to put a pressure on you but to you under the talents that uh, hidden in your uh, self if you see the statistics of uh, the various success stories across the world wherever you see many successful persons in the globe have the roots of our country as a born here a brought up there are they for and born here or they might have born and brought up in other country the publications and the patents these are the two points uh, which probably the it sector will not uh, uh, concentrate but any country should uh, grow in the education the sector first and then uh, the industry sector second the based on the two important uh, success stories one is the publications and the other one is the patents we the indians are strong in uh, publishing the research articles uh, in various reputed institutions but we fail to convert our publications into the patents whatever the reasons might be but at least uh, if you see the past five years uh, the various uh, measures taken by the state government and the central government there is a tremendous growth in the filing the patents and also granting the getting the grants of other patents nearly a 50% increase in the last couple of years but this uh, figure will not uh, match with the world uh, rankings we are at the third or fourth place in terms of the publications but somewhere at the ninth or tenth place in terms of the patents one of the reason for uh, such a low grade in terms of the patents is uh, there is no such ecosystem in the educational institutions people were taught the subjects people were trained uh, in various coding systems people were finally trying to face the interviews for the jobs and landing at uh, a particular company but it is the high time i request the chairman and secretary of this institution you have crossed several uh, success stories and now it is the time to concentrate on providing an ecosystem uh, in the campus so that each and every student should bring their ideas as a real their ideas must be transformed to the product i request uh, mohan mr mohan to see that uh, the institution should should, uh, should have uh, such a ecosystem uh, where uh, the students can concentrate on their ideas work on uh, their ideas and try to transform their ideas into the products they not only just transform the products let the product be published and let the product be presented in the ip portal and let the product be granted a patent ultimately the patent has a economic value not the publication so my humble request uh, for all the gp set uh, graduating students at least from now onwards wherever you go across the globe you try to work on your ideas transforming your ideas into the product and bring the laurels to this institution and to the state and to the country at last and the second point i would like to communicate uh, to all the graduating students is one thing uh, the think globally and search locally so you think globally for the solutions 
and you, we have a lot of problems in and around our place our people are required a lot of uh, solutions you try to concentrate uh, identify some of the local problems and try to give the solutions for the local people with the same concept uh, the government of andhra pradesh has come up with a beautiful idea incorporating a community service projects in the second year for all the graduating students with a motto to concentrate on the nearby people they need a lot of uh, solutions for their problems you as a young graduating students can can give a solutions for your uh, people in and around you i request the management uh, please concentrate on the the community service uh, projects see that uh, in and our, around our people uh, have a solutions for their uh, problems so with these few words i thank the organizers for give, uh, inviting me to this uh, first graduation day of your uh, graduating uh, students i wish all the graduating students a happy healthy and prosperous future life thank you very much wish you all the best jai hind thank you so much sir so this year nearly uh, 24 patents have been filed by the institution sir and also aacd has given the opportunity for the college to conduct a smart india hackathon for this academic year uh, which is going to happen on 24 25th and 26th uh, where the students across the country will be participating in, the, in that particular event so we will take that as an opportunity and definitely we will continue the uh, publishing articles and patents and as rightly mentioned by chakravarti sir uh, Uh, the two challenges which he, which uh, of course every year he is uh, giving some challenges to me so i am ready to take uh, to take all those challenges so with all these challenges i think definitely gp gpcet and ravindra will uh, flourish in the coming days and definitely uh, we will fulfill the dreams of the uh, karnul uh, region team region students so thank you so much sir I request our beloved chairman sir and secretary sir to kindly state the chief guest and guest of honor. So, madam, first university nominee, madam. भवानी मैडम I now request our Honorable Vice Chancellor Sir to kindly accept the invitation.
Next I request our uh, guest of honor, Chakravati sir, to kindly accept the presentation. So next I request our guest of honor, Sandra Sekar sir, to kindly accept the first question. Thank you, sir. So, having come out of the uh, I would like to request our board chairman, sir, the following. Sir, so do I have the permission of the chairman to close the graduation day ceremony? Thank you.
Thank you, sir. I declare the graduation ceremony closed. And with these few words, I request all the dignitaries on the dais and also the students, parents to please raise for national anthem. पंजाब सिंध गुजरात मराठा प्राविण उत्तर बंगा इंद्र हिमाचल यमुना गंगा उच्चल जगति तरंगा तब शुभ नामे जागे तब शुभ आशीष मांगे गाहे तब जय गाथा जनगण मंगल नायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विधाता जय हे जय हे जय हे जय 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 हे I, I request all the students to stand until the procession leaves that area. Okay? We have to put it in the room. We have to लाल आदि वेरो आदि वेरा आदि वेरो आदि क्या निर्देश बैठ जाना माने अलग उठ दोना रहा
ఆయిల్లో పెట్టినందుకు అక్కడ ఉన్నది చాలా గట్లా పెట్టినారు ఐదు ఐదు సార్లు ఐదు సార్లు పెట్టినారు అవసాన తీసుకొని వచ్చేసా ఫైవ్ మినిట్స్